Alright, baby booties. It's no, I don't like that. Yeah, no, we do. Yeah. Take two. All right, butts. It's time for more Star Force 2. Alright, child asses. <laughs> oh no. I mean I just went with butts. But well, you said baby booties. First. The first time I did. It's true. We could roll back the tape, but we're literally less than a minute into the video. You can you can hit zero. Just watch the yeah, intro here. It's yeah, fun. Press left twice on your keyboard. You'll figure Ooh, it out. Oh, it stayed in place. Well not in place, it stayed in the same like Column. row. Row, yeah. Which is conveniente. Well, is welcome Spanish back, everyone. For Sticky We're Rain 2 Star 3. That's pretty good card to get uh, from a random encounter. Yeah, that's just a good... We don't usually get star cards as fight rewards. I think Flicker Kick is, is going to be a better one than this. It's on type and it does more. Yeah. I, yeah. I think that the idea for Sticky Rain is a similar idea to Flicker Kick, but it's in one spot. But like... But and I also the we don't type have stuff is, an elemental advantage. Yeah. That's, yeah. Anyway, I believe we're off to our last real... Oh, hi, Green. Oh, and also that, which we should go do after this. I think there's one yes. in the bottom right also. Yeah. Um, we are... Wow. Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, deep into the post game in Mega Man Star Force uh, 2 Zerker. Zerk. Zerker. I'm Jeff. I am Rick. And we're still fucking doing the post game. We are. Um, again, though, both of us have now said independently of each other at different times... I think mostly off mic talking about recording this game, but like this post game doesn't feel like soul crushing. No, for some reason, it's been slow and long. Like not like in a horrible way. It's just generally been paced uh, out a little bit on the slow that's side. Post game styling, yeah. right? Like you're not, you just kind of stretch it out. Like all right, you love the game so much, you want more. All right, we'll, we'll put together another another couple hours for Something, you. Something, yeah. yeah. But, like, it hasn't been horrible. Nope. And... Oh, no, it's a healing asshole. Which one heals? I still have the card finder on, too. I've made mistakes today. Uh, I, I've already the, forgot what I was going to say. The dance fire? Which one was the healer? Yeah, the dance question. fire, I believe. Oh, huh. Oh, shit. Um, wow. We are just talking about... Um, Post game and how it feels, and for some yeah. reason this one does not feel soul crushing. It's been long, as all post games are, but you know, it hasn't been bad. Yeah, it hasn't been. We've certainly done like dealt with worse. It it has the potential to get really bad because I mean that's yeah. some of the post games in in previous Battle Network games we've played have been good until they weren't. Yeah, and then they really weren't, kind of thing. Uh, okay. Well, thanks for dodging us, Malay. Oh, I should have used the... Uh... Actually, no, I did this wrong twice. Yeah, you need to line up I waited up for him, him in the middle, then I could have done that, and he would have gone... Yeah, regardless. We can still line up with him, and they'll both hit. Yeah. Would have. Hey, Dance Fire 3 is one of the ones we wanted anyway. Okay, check mark. Uh, so let's take off that for now, because we don't really need it yet. Um... We're going to get through this whole thing and not actually find all of Land's memos, aren't we? <laughs> if we don't find them by the time we've cleared all the conditions for the final super bosses, we should just look up well, at that point. Oh, yeah. Are. Just just run and grab them all. Yeah. <clears throat> 190. Off-camera running. Radiating three panels ahead. That's an interesting... It might be a cone. Yeah, probably. Because everything was a T-shape, which I think means at the very end. So maybe it's more like um, Taurus Fire, where it's like just, yeah, One, cone two, three. Thing, yeah. Interesting, but yeah, if we get to the very end, we should we should at that point look it up because like, then it's like, oh well, it'd be nice to at least see those. Well, that's that's I mean, it's interesting lore stuff to see yeah. the old like you know lands writings from hundreds of years ago. Ooh, a purple thing there. I had to have choose. Oh, one. and here's Guys Fox. One least favorite thing about Star Force is that Star Force made every character from Battle Network a skeleton. Yeah. Everybody's dead and has been for I mean at minimum a century. Yeah. It's it's like it's almost like too much time to oh, really be weird yeah. about, but also at the same time it's like, oh it kind of 
feels weird to just have fast forwarded past the entire life and times yeah. of everyone in Battle Network. And I wouldn't now we're... mind a, a late, you know, an adult Lan Hikari doing stuff. Yeah, or even a gr- grandpa, Grandpa Hikari, sitting around being like, "When I was your age, the internet was tubes or something. <laughs> the internet was a bunch of platforms, and they existed elsewhere. <laughs> Everything fucking just pulsed always. Oh, oh I don't shit." Know why. Uh, this kind of sucks because I'm not able to do this. My computer was my little brother. <laughs> he lived longer than me because <laughs> he's still alive. <laughs> he's still twelve because he's computer. Oh no, guys! Fox has a look of sadness. As well, it should. <laughs> that damn shieldy yeah. thing. It was better to just do this and well, you get rid of him. Oof. Yo, how a do? Whoop it a do! Crazy thing is that most notable people throughout history yeah. have, in fact, turned into skeletons. That's true. Most which, people are dead. Yeah, which really concerns me because <laughs> who's 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 doing that? Yeah, who is Where, making the skeletons? There's and a necromancer. How do we get them to stop? Amongst us somewhere, and they just keep making skeletons. Nobody seems all that concerned about making that guy not do that anymore. I don't no. know. Seems kind of rude, but I mean, it felt it would, feels like a bigger problem than than how people treat it. So, whoa, hi, buddy. <laughs> he went for the punch. Ah, oh, damn it! He got the fist. I don't know why I I don't I don't know why I bothered doing that. <laughs> hey, that guy, was very dumb. Guy Fox, you have a leaf on your head. It's still um, all right. No, well, he's dead now. I tried to kick it off, but I missed. No, nope, I missed. I got you in the face. I'm sorry. Three times. I can do it again if you think that'll help. Oh, hey! Get my thunder. So where's Kung Fu Kid? I don't think we fought Kung Fu Kid, did we? Am um, I stupid? We we did two rather long sessions like a month ago, so... Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rick and I did a lot of Star Force in one sitting that we're... I think we're still going... Yeah, we're... Uh, as we of have this another three recording. weeks that haven't even come out yet. Yeah, yeah. There's still stuff in the can from last week, so we're just trying to get ahead, but... Yeah. Um, uh, oh. We might not ever fight... Um, well, so Cancer Bubble the kid because we fought the other boss in Scobland. Like we fought, didn't we? We fought Plesio Surf Aya. I guess though. Though again, we fought we fought Cancer Bubble, so it makes sense. Also, Gemini Thunder is in the same kind of family of stuff too. That same group of like optional. Yeah, I guess Gemini wasn't really central to this game's plot. Of it wasn't. Yeah, so yeah they, they totally were, incidental. You could actually. Potentially come here and find well, Gemini Thunder here yeah. before finding Pat actually seeing Pat. in the real world yep. also here. Yeah. Dance Fire Three again, great. All right, that's just a whoops. Oh, just we actually can't go south. So. Okay, I'm kind of bummed by the fact that there was like one place in one of these areas that actually went somewhere, and now they're like, yeah, we're not gonna. Everything we're, else we're not is gonna just keep one screen. That. Don't worry about it. Uh, holy panels, really. Take half damage. Yeah, it's just annoying. Uh, it it really doesn't even matter. <laughs> just hurry up and get roasted. Foosh. <laughs> nice. Yep. Yeah, I said it earlier, but. When when we start Star Force three. Oh damn it! Why did I? I'm so stupid. We got to make a whole day about it. We should stream the first couple of episodes recording. Oh god, I don't know. I I feel like it's just easier for us to be able to like. The, the my biggest problem when it comes to streaming, the video quality always comes out ultimately worse than just recording. Plus, people are well using a local record of what you. Oh yeah. Export. Yeah, I'm I, like. Don't you just record the whole scene and then transplant the scene into the other scene so I do. you get a fresh recording of the... Is it recorded a bad codec or something? Uh, I think it's just generally got to do with the... just how much data it's processing at once. Okay. Like, it's just too much stuff for XSplit to be, like, properly handling, I Making guess. Making it unhappy. I Is see. my guess. Like, I don't I don't know that for certain. I just... Mm -hmm. That's my assumption. But... Well, we gotta do, we gotta do something big. 
Who? Oh, hi, Giant Face G. Oh, wow. That's what they used to call me in high school. <laughs> They were really rude. It, weirdly, it was just because my face was giant. Oh. I don't really get where the I name came I thought it was because of... It do, yeah. It, yeah it, doesn't, it didn't really make much sense to me, but that was what, that was what they called me. Just unloading gigantic piles of damage on this asshole. And... Oh, fuck that up. Oh, wow, he, he fast. He moved double speed. Oh, hi, that was rude. God damn it, they're working together. <laughs> you little bitches. Stop cooperating. Yeah, Mom said it's my turn to cooperate. Fox Foo's just gonna leave you. It always does. Like this. See? Here we go. All he left you was explosions. Moifall three star one. Which makes sense, because it was a G. Yeah. So I wanted to go this way first. Just got the teleporter. Yeah. And... Oh, that's not no, where I, I thought that was gonna go. That yeah, into the same area. Well, I just thought because there was a, there's at least one other porter like teleporter spot. Right. That I thought we were going into that we didn't. Oh no, crab. Oh god, it's sea cancro. Uh, Our greatest enemy. Sure, let's just do a bunch of this. Time to mommy finger him. Um. Uh, how? What? <laughs> I'm not. I'm not familiar with that particular technique. It's, I don't know. It's this card. Ah. Uh, Mommy finger three. Ah, stealth Lazar two. I that picture is almost unintelligible to me. <laughs> it eventually Stu registered as some sort of flying thing shooting lasers. I think. What do you think the last card we have to get here is, Jeffrey? Oh no. Um. Does it involve the fucking crab? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? 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 Jeff. That's crazy. Jeff. Yes. I would Chain never. Level three. Just who could even? I don't even. When it's you're even like you can't say that. When it isn't, then. Oh god wow. damn it! We sit there for ten seconds and nothing hit us. <laughs> Oh my god! Okay. This is a bad combination of enemies. <laughs> la 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 Tra la 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 shit. <laughs> there we yeah, go. Let's just whip it. That'll take out at least two of them, I It'll think. It'll get all three. Oh yeah, right. Moai's the... Uh, Bang! Wrong element. I made the sound of a gun. Hey! Is that the first this heal like, we've seen in the whole ass game? No, but it's the first one we've seen in a whole ass fucking long time. Why is this? Because eggs in um, Cliff. That whole teleporter zone is just that, it's patrolling. The, it's the same structure as the normal was at. I guess. Like, I'm about 90% sure that that teleporter goes to the same place. Oh, we got a buddy here. the layout is all the same. He's going to die. Uh-oh. <laughs> He's going to die a lot. He's about to get his ass eat by a giant face Whoa. real quick. Oh no! No! <laughs> oh, he cried before he passed away, Rick. <laughs> he had just enough time to shed tears god damn before it. he expired. Oh god damn it! Uh, <laughs> how could you? Beep beep. Uh, <laughs> like this. Stab 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 stab. Gee, I've never been so proud of you. Oh god. I hate those. I'm ashamed guys. of myself. I hate those guys. I'll be honest. Oh fuck! We got a lot of shots. I have to get along with them, but I don't like them. We got a lot of shot. Oh, stop through it. Not only we need this card, but like, yeah. I can do a tornado too. Get him. Sorry, I meant like this. I can do a tornado too. <laughs> oh, because I had my healing first. I was like, why didn't I do my thing? My tornado's much better. My tornado's bigger and leafier. And windier. So windy. It blows so hard. Do you remember me from the first game? <laughs> it's okay. Nobody else does yes, too. Yes, I do! <laughs> Shut up. Okay! I hate all of you guys. <laughs> what is your Leo Kingdom one? Oh, it was just Shatner. <laughs> yeah. Just loud and big voice. Loud and strange cadence to the speed. 
<laughs> and I chose it because I expected there to be a bunch of monologues, and then, <laughs> and then literally fucking the dragon would speak for 45 minutes, yeah. and then it'd be like, what say you, Leo Kingdom? And it'd be like, yes! <laughs> it's it. Yes! The one thing he says and in then, a... Tw- yeah. <laughs> and then back to the fucking Pegasus horse. Pegasus Magic spoke for hours at a time! And then Leo Kingdom would go, yes! <laughs> I don't know why they decided to just not fucking write me there. Chose the two for hardest Leo voices for the two most monologue oh. characters. Oh my god, it was terrible. Did Leo Kingdom the game? Well, obviously they wouldn't know before they sold the game. It was like it did. did people just not Whoops. like Leo Kingdom or ah Ow. fucky ducky? Don't laser us. I just. That sound effect of shooting lasers. Pew, 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 the, do, do, do. the thing it, the one it shot. Yeah. I do not know what game that is from, but I know it is. That has been reused oh, in multiple games. It's. Oh, you might have recognized it from Mega Man Star Force Two Zerker. Oh, yeah. or uh, Saurian, you mean? Or um, if you ever heard uh, Ninja? Yes. Yes. Yeah. The third element. Yes. Dinosaur, uh, Muscle Man, and Ninja. And Ninja. Yeah. 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 Yes, exactly. <laughs> the three main food groups. <laughs> I am, I'm, th- I'm so annoyed. I can hear the sound effect repeating in my head over and over because it's so familiar now, but I don't know what game it is from. Always. Wow. Ouch. Oh, hi. Oh, boy. Oh, God. <laughs> uh-huh. Looks like you're in a pretty tough place there, <laughs> my man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. You need a lot of help, little guy. I kicked a lot of people today. I need a lot of help, Tails. <laughs> Tails, you got to help me. I think... <laughs> My Sonic the Hedgehog voice is just my <laughs> is just a less nerdy version of my Geostellar. <laughs> Wait a minute, we're the same thing. I'm also drifting into Shatner Zone with that too. I gotta I gotta I gotta hone in my my Sonic voice. Yeah, it's it's almost like half fun and half sad that mm-hmm. whenever we get a new <laughs> that, that's the D-pad colon. Yeah, it's like almost half fun and half sad. Half fun and half sad. Um, no, it's half fun and half sad to watch episodes where a new character voice comes in and we just panic and do something stupid. <laughs> yeah. And then, and then like, we realize, oh, we're stuck with that Oh, now. no, this is the most verbose character in the entire yeah. game. Oh, shit. And sometimes in my head, I hear me do a voice when I'm watching an episode. Yeah. And I'm like, oh, my God, bro. What have I you done? You could have done 60 better voices if you had thought for 11 seconds yeah, instead of one. The most minor amount of additional thought would have made Three this. or four, like, I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to. Or, or just test out a couple of things yep. to go with something. We just, But we just kept... You know, we had to grab what we were given, and <laughs> that's the funny. D-pad motto. D-pad, grab what you're given. Here we go. D-pad. It's D-pad. in the W-Y-G. W-Y-G. Grab what, what you're, you're given. You're given. Oh, G-W-Y-G. I said G-W-Y-G. Oh, did you say G? Okay. I did. I never forget a G. I'm used to both of them in my name. Wait. Oh no! Use the. Uh, oh, this will that work pretty well. Might count. It, again, okay. he looks. Yeah, he was mostly in the center con- column. Oh shit! I got all three. I didn't even realize. Nice. Oh, I figured out what it was. What was it? Halo. <laughs> okay. The do do do. That three laser sound <gasps> is from Halo. Oh damn it! I'm like, can I actually go? No, no I can't. Okay, that's interesting, though. I'm I'm a million percent sure. All if right. any of you listening to the video want to go back... If you've ever heard of a, a little game called Halo... It's a small video game franchise from a little company named Microsoft. So ha- a Halo, if you're not familiar, is like a circle? Yes, I know Bungie made Halo before I get comments about this, but they are owned by Microsoft now. Yeah. Bungie is Microsoft, so... <laughs> Press you know, the delete key, you son of a bitch. You know, like Banjo-Kazooie, famously made by Microsoft. <laughs> yeah. You remember them? Yeah. They made your computer. Hey, kid. I'm a computer. Go here. Um. Yeah. 
It's weird to look back on who owns what now. Yeah. Yeah. It's a strange. Doink. No, I like I liked Bungie ever since like System Shock. Back in the Marathon days. Yeah, the, the Marathon. You know the famous <laughs> game Marathon. Yeah, that's my favorite king in Lord of the Rings. Yeah. Um. Yeah. No. Bungie, like a lot, it, they were less well known because they made you know PC games in an era where the PC was not that common. Yeah. Like less so than a Super Nintendo. Yeah. Um. But. You know, they're good fucking games, and when Halo came out on the Xbox, I was like, oh, no shit, it's really good. <laughs> but, oh, B Bungie made this? Okay. Hey, we got shit crab. Thank you. Goodbye, shit eating grin crab. I hate your face, so mean and shifty. Hope shit in hell. I don't trust you at all. It also means once we're done here, we can just, like, leave. Again, my favorite part of post-game is checking off areas as... Never returns. Dunzo McGonzo. Yep. Let's do this. What vaguely racist areas do you think we'll be going to in the next <laughs> Star Wars? <laughs> oh, no. Who haven't they? Who haven't they done a, a somewhat awkward caricature of yet? Oh, they could. They could do a really terribly uh, inappropriate joke with a uh, fake Mexico and call it like Napland. I, I guess they haven't done Siesta Mexico zone. specifically. They've done South America and Central America like twice now. Yeah. But I guess they haven't strictly done Mexico yet. The most central of the Americas. If anyone out there is a... Uh, I was going to say a big Gundam fan, but really it's more like a fake Gundam fan like me. Uh, and watched G Gundam and haven't seen any of the other ones. You'll be very familiar with how they decided to handle uh, Space Mexico... <laughs> oh, okay. Holy boy. Um, I mean, there's a lot of examples of that kind of shit in that era. Yep. It was it's it was one where even at the time I was just like, "Wow, we're we're making some choices today." Yep. Yep. Uh it's like, you know, Mr. Popo from Dragon Ball Z or Jinx from Pokémon. It's like, "Oh, it's inspired by like you know, the minstrel show style, yeah, you know, black like, makeup, and it's like, no, don't do that. Yeah, that's, we, we... We get that it's inspired by something historical, but don't, stop, yeah, that's stop a, doing that. That's one we try not to revisit if we can manage. It, enough. <laughs> that, that's a, that's a, uh, hmm. That's not a, that's not, that's not one of our favorite moments. <laughs> cool reason. Don't do it. Yeah. <laughs> thanks. No thanks. Uh, Yeah. Uh, the so the premise of uh, G Gundam oh is <laughs> at some point in the future I forget exactly when uh, the Earth is I think the Earth is mostly like fucked and like essentially all of the countries have created their own space colonies they're floating around in space there's like a Neo Japan or Neo Tokyo yeah. there's Neo Mexico Neo America all this stuff uh, and uh, the the way that they w the, the replacement for waging war is giant mecha battles in a tournament. Yep. And essentially, whoever wins gets to be the head of the, the new of world government. Yeah. Until the next one. Uh, and Neo Mexico has a giant. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the Gundam is named Tequila Gundam. Yep. And it has a giant sombrero. It's shaped, I think, like a big. Cactus with a sombrero? I think. I, I forget about the cactus, cactus part. Yo. I know it had a big sombrero. Hard to miss the sombrero. Uh, it was a... Oh, thank you for stepping right in there. That was one where, like, it shows up and I'm just like, Oh, oh, no. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh-oh. Tequila Gundam has a sombrero. It's got elements on its body that are cactus-like. Yeah. Um, it's just like, oof. And also, its weapon is like a three-pronged trident that looks like a fucking farm oh, implement. Yeah. Like a, a hay. Uh, what do you call that? Who goes there? I'm Mega Man, and I came here to put out Apollo's flame. With a, with a, I have a little, it's like a bell, but hollow, and I'm just going <laughs> to like put just it on his head. Drop it right on. <clears throat> We're going to put the smack down on you and open up that warp hole. Wait, hold Wait, on. Wait, no, no. Uh, it's, sorry, hang on. That wasn't I, what we meant. I am going to physically assault you, yes. but not. Yeah, we're not gonna. That's not. Yeah. We're not doing that. You, like, that just, was just. 
it we just came through a, a war poll pure, earlier, pure violence. so it just kind of it's, it's okay. Yeah, should we just start killing? Yeah, let's I do think. it. All right, Kurg, Kurg, Kurg. Fat okay? chance. Oh, okay. Got a in the back of your throat. Yeah. I never learned how to laugh. Leave, or I'll be forced to delete you. Let's just delete him and get this over with. I said leave. We've got business with Apollo. We're Gemini Spark IF, and we run things around here. What? Everyone has said that. What do you F? Tower. Yeah. In this Pull dimension, right in. it's I fuck tower. Oh, just I fuck tower. Yeah. <laughs> Je- Gemini Spark EF but EF but W. To IF tower. Okay. Two 1800 power dudes are going to be a mess to yeah, deal with. Yeah, that's a lot. And there's going to be more moving around on the screen than we're used yep. to in previous battles. I'm just going to start doing damage where I can, and we're going to do the best we can. Yep. <clears throat> oh, oh, what? Come on, you asshole. Oh, oh thank God. Right, okay. Paid off. I was really worried that, like, just for... Just Two spider Man pointing at each other meme. <laughs> yeah. Wait. <laughs> oh, nice. That actually worked out really nicely. I appreciate that this doesn't have, like, the Pokemon immunity of electric Pokemon not being able to be... Paid to be paralyzed. Paralyzed, yeah. yeah. That's kind of a big win here. It would be a giant pain in the ass. That's <clears throat> get ready to get flicker kicked. How'd that feel? Oh! That's right. Interrupted. I think, I, yeah, I think you did fully interrupt it. Ow, Ouch. Ow. Not that, though. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, God, he's trying to fist us. <laughs> uh, not again. Don't double fist no! us. No! Oh, I, I was trying to hit the Pegasus magic. And you did. I accidentally scrolled past it. One, two, That's quick. okay. We're still going to get 600 damage to both of them. Uh, they're oh, no. Yeah, they're weak to uh, that. They're I dead. I to say, no, that's that. That's... Fucking hilarious. Yeah. Wood element, baby. Oh my god. I mean, honestly, this wouldn't have been an immensely difficult fight. It would have just taken us getting a, a, a dragon sky and Correct. using it effectively. Ugh. Yeah. Yarg! Isn't that. Oh, like sorry, did I have a line? Zach and. and like. I'm sorry, Luna what? Said? <laughs> what did you say? Somebody said my voice. Or. <laughs> wait, what? Pat. Somebody said my name. Don't worry, that's not Pat. Anyway, we can't think about that now, because he's dead. Imagine going through this game and then, apropos of nothing, going up against Gemini Thunder IF and being like, wait, w uh, what? Like, not meeting him, not meeting Pat before that. I, I, that would be very strange just to be like, oh. Super surprise appearance. Well, I mean, it, it does kind of make sense because this is an alternate future or alternate dimension basically i suppose but bringing back old bosses out of nowhere in the post game is like whoa sure yeah S -s strange but if you played star force 2 you'd understand but you'd be surprised yeah or one if you, you won, never yeah. played one you'd be like who the like, fuck is i this don't guy? understand yeah. yeah who's pat all right seals been broken is that all of them are we gonna get a message of that never should have broke the seal oh didn't say anything about it oh you know what I wonder mm -hmm. if you even have to fight these guys at all, because the seal has been broken, but that's on those doors that were opening up in the trans dimension area. We had to come in here for cards regardless, so it's not like we wasted our time, mm -hmm. but like, I'm genuinely curious if we could have just gone straight into battle. Like, could we have just gone into the next room and fought Apollo Flam? I don't know. I say in episode like 18 or so <laughs> yeah, of, yeah, of the post game. Doing all this shit. I, I have a feeling that there would be some kind of blocker. Like it would be very strange to set up a boss refight rush. Yeah. And then be like, oh, but also you don't have to do this. You could just go in. Right? Like maybe in the maybe when we get to the next room, there's gonna be a thing that's like that's, oh there's a gate that says until all of the seals have been broken something yeah cannot. or each of them has their own seal because they love doing that shit because they're did, like here's did, the cancer bubble seal and here's the harp note didn't seal. some of the early uh, bosses unlock subsequent bosses like is when we so. killed one didn't it take the wall oh, down oh you shit that's a dance fire ah or were they just always down. Say that again. Sorry. So when we when we went into like the little boss rush room and we beat a boss, did it then unlock another boss, or were they just always? They were all open from the start. Were they? Okay. Yeah. So then I, it's it's gotta be that there's a seal in the next room. 
Because it said Gemini Spark Seal has been yeah. broken, so either it's something that's never on screen and it makes no sense. Well, there's or those doors on the side that specify bosses that have to be defeated for you to go through them. The like the pink the pink, pink laser line. bars. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> and they stay up and like we've already taken one of them down, but we haven't looked at the other two yet. Yeah. I don't know what's going on over here, but I am curious before we go. I'm probably just gonna it's pulse out once we're done looking, so I'm just walking back through all of this shit for no reason. Um You would pulse out to I would probably pulse out I think I would pulse out all the way to Echo Ridge, Echo but Ridge, right? it yeah. does not take long to get back to No, I guess from the Echo Ridge entry point in the alternate dimension, it's not such a big deal to get back to like the central hub. Here we go. Yeah, it take being and it would also be between episodes. We're going to end the episode at any second now anyway. <laughs> Which one? I don't know. Okay. We haven't picked the number yet. All right. Well, once you do, let me know. I will. <laughs> we'll, just, we'll just end the episode. With, it'll just be silence for a couple seconds and then power! Yeah. And like the... <laughs> and we'll just come back in the middle of a sentence for the next one. It's fine. Oh, nice. That actually works. <laughs> I didn't think it was going to hit him, but... Yay! Yeah. He didn't move. You got a free TB play. Yep, okay, yeah, I'm getting know. there. <laughs> Working on it. There we go. A thousand it would be nice if... Later. There's a part of me that wishes you could opt to have your special card come in immediately versus at the end. Like, I get why they opt to not do that, since you could be trying to change shit together. Yeah. I... I don't know, I, I get it, that it goes on the end of the stack as, yeah. like, you know, you hit something with this, and then you still have another card before that, so you don't want to right. waste it, but... No, I mean, I, I do get it. It's just one of those, like, meh kind yeah. of situation, you know? I think a quality of life improvement in this game would be making non-attack, non-aiming cards just instant and automatic. Like... What do you mean? So the... the in well, like, previous no wind-up? Yeah, in, stuff. in previous Battle Network, in the Battle Network series, the yeah. plus tens were cards that you paired. Oh, you yeah, you and that you shouldn't have to freeze the screen to add the tens. Correct, and and even like the ten Ooh. panel thing is interesting. Wood grenade star three. Wood grenade. Oh, it's it's heat grenade except wood. Yeah, that's interesting. That would have been good to have before. 140 wood damage, so 280 against. Yeah. Uh, it's, I mean, it's better, but I can't put it there. I have to put it in my star cards, and we have better Correct. star cards. and we have no wood grenade non-star cards, Yeah, I not think. that we need it in order to use that, but we will eventually need a wood grenade anyway. It just, if the, with limited star card slots, yeah. it behooves us to only use star cards that we will use additional Yeah, generally set, speaking, set yeah. yeah. Uh, well, why don't we call it here? When we come back next time, I believe we're going to walk in, we're going to check both of the gates that should now be open, and then we're going to head into Apollo Flame, or at the very least, the next room. We don't really know what's in there yet. Hell yeah, yeah. Into the breach. See you then. Bye. Get on it. Yeah, man.